In its final leg of event for this financial year, Global Panorama Showcase once again demonstrated a strong connection in Pune. We are actually concluding the 10th city that is for this financial year 22-23 and uh, we have gone completely on a sustainable uh, platform. Adoption of uh, technology is the way forward for the industry and people are accepting it and uh, adopting it. What we are noticing is that uh, Pune uh, as a city has very strong business links with the UK. Uh, obviously, uh, we are all aware about uh, Serum Institute of India who have invested heavily in the UK and worked with partners in the UK to create a path-breaking uh, COVID vaccine. So we are witnessing a lot of traffic uh, uh, traveling between the two countries uh, from multiple sectors. Like every uh, big category town, Pune has really come up really, really well. Uh, for uh, Especially for Asia, for us, it's done exceedingly well. GPS is focusing on a tier two cities and all these things. I really appreciate. And uh, this time the GPS have attended. There are a lot of new exhibitors and they are quality people. The major sectors which are booming currently are the domestic ones along with it even the international is there so definitely we can see there is a huge growth after the pandemic i think it's a lot, it's a lot of education that you get here really uh, you need a lot of people down here uh, i realized that gps really brings you in touch with a lot of the tier two tier three uh, travel agents who we don't really get to meet on a regular basis working from the major metros uh, so this is a great connect for us i have always noticed gps is always having up-to-date market information in terms of uh, what is happening in the new trends we would like to have uh direct connectivity with uh, more connectivity in fact with middle east far east and europe if possible that's what exactly we are looking at